Peace be with you and welcome back to my channel for another video, another spiritual download. If this is the first time that you're coming across my channel, I say hey, hi, and hello. You are more than welcome to like, share, subscribe, unsubscribe, comment, erase your comment, go back and edit it. Listen, listen, listen. Whatever you feel <laughs> that your spirit is guiding you here to do, I wholeheartedly support you in that energy. I promise to the most high heavens that I do. I know that you coming across my platform is not by coincidence. Nine times out of 10, there is going to be a message here for you. Needless to say, let me go ahead and get a sip of my vanilla bean. <laughs> Two shots of espresso coffee, one moment. Okay, that was a commercial break for the newcomers. Listen, you'll get used to the commercial breaks. We'll break you in. We'll get you used to those commercial breaks. If you're returning back to the channel, you already know. It's only been one or two videos since I've seen you. I think about you always. I love you from here until however far love can go. I love you to the moon and back and even beyond that. We are here together again and we're very victorious. We're going through a very mass ascension. I know it's very uncomfortable, isn't it? Facing those things that need to be shifted and or changed in our lives. I'm getting a level of obedience, a level of obedience. Okay, listen, I'm going to go ahead and just get into this energy because it came by way of my desk. One of my subscribers shared something with me about somebody that reads tarot. Okay, this is a really interesting energy because... I really didn't know how to process this energy. And when I sat with spirit to ask whether or not I needed to channel this, I was advised that this would be a good thing just to expose the situation. Now, nine times out of 10, when we're exposing people, places and things, it's not to annihilate them. If they're working in a dark energy, they annihilate themselves all by themselves. They really don't need any help sinking their own battleship. And this is why they're mad. Their demonic forces are angry. They're still stuck in their shadow and they're trying to find a way to get in. And everything that they're sending to you is literally bouncing off of the full armor of the most high God, the helmet of salvation. It's just bouncing off of you. Okay, listen, let me go ahead and get into this energy. I've already called in my appropriate protection. I pray that you've done the same, but I will call upon the highest of white lights here with you. Only the highest of white lights. Anything other than the highest of white lights, please close that door, please, and thank you. This person is angry because now they're transparent. Yeah, listen, cancer and energy. Okay. Yeah. This person, oh gosh, my goodness. The temperance in reverse represents somebody doing something in excess. This could be abuse of power. This could be... Oh, God, there could be so much going on here. Excessive behavior, impulsive. Thank you, spirit. Could be dealing with the cancer. This person that's channeling this energy could be a, a water sign. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Beware of excessive behaviors, impulsive addictions, imbalance, vices, all right? I just heard racism, which is how somebody gave me this particular uh, channel. Yeah, this is how I got, this is how I got this video. Show me more. Show me more into this tarot card reader. Who is this? Wish fulfillment, okay? What they're doing, they really like what they're doing, but they could have done something impulsively and said something that was politically incorrect and it came off a little uh, racist and discriminatory. Very impulsive. Yeah, this person has issues with letting go, okay? They could read their cards with the mirror in front of their cards. Yeah, they're a little sneaky and deceptive in the way that they act impulsively. Uh, this person is really angry because they're transparent. They don't like the fact that somebody is seeing into their spiritual case. But again, this person is putting themselves in the forefront 
Yeah, definitely a water sign energy, King of Cups energy. They're putting themselves in the forefront to be seen. And because they were spiritually negligent, okay, impulsively, I heard, saying things impulsively now that they can't take back. Okay, that could have been a racial slur. Maybe they felt comfortable with a certain race of people that they felt as though they could do that. Okay, this person now wants to move forward. This person's embarrassed and they cannot come back from that. Yeah, Queen of Cups energy, not a bad person, just did something out of haste and very impulsive, okay? They could be dealing with some type of an addiction, whoever this person is. Yeah, the Empress is here, very caring and loving person. This person did something uh, regretfully, y'all, okay? This person wants to come back and help people, but they need to go within. Spirit could be guiding this person to go within, in some way, shape, or form, okay? Going within, yeah. Catering to the inner child. Yeah, this is a tower. Something got very chaotic very, very quickly. I just heard a Freudian slip, subconscious slip. This person said something that was not good, and they did it on accident. But really, Spirit is saying this needed to be exposed because this is the way they talk behind the scenes. This is what they really want to say. So how else can you change unless you're transparent in front of the people that you're trying to, to help and guide? Show me what else I need to see. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, things are not as though they appear. All right, so the Empress energy and the King of Cups energy and the Knight of Wands energy is all surface energy. What lurks beneath the surface is somebody that could be a little mean, very moody, very uh, deceptive, okay? But on the surface comes off as somebody that wants to help people, guide people, um, lead them to their path, but something came out in them. And again, I don't believe that they thought that they would expose that part of themselves and they can't come back from it. It's unfortunate. This is just going to be a really short video. Yeah. This person is losing it. They're trying to come back and save grace and save face, but somebody caught the fact that they said something really nasty towards a certain race of people. Okay. This person has identity issues. They're very intuitive. They've abused their power. Again, on the surface, they look very, very caring and loving. But what lurks beneath the surface is a two-faced person. This is deceptive energy. They're stressed out. Anxiety, sad. How could I have done that? They literally destroyed themselves in front of the world. The sun is here. Things have been illuminated. Show me more. This person is trying to go in a new direction trying to save face, trying to act like they didn't say what they said. They could have said something, like I said, I don't want to get too deep, but they said something racist and they have a lot of people who follow them. Yeah, they got people that follow them that are of a certain race, okay? Now they're trying to go in a new direction. Show me what else I need to see. Yeah, this person is broken hearted. Spirit says this needed to be exposed. As we're all under judgment in spiritual court, things like this need to be exposed. Okay. Because people really trusted this person. Spirit sat this person down. This person had a huge following. This is very hurtful and heartbreaking for people that trusted in this person's spiritual guidance. To know that this person really thought a certain way about a certain race of people and or group of people. There's conflict. People are not sitting down about this issue. Yeah, Gabriel's blowing a horn and it's urgent. Yeah, they're not sitting down. Something was illuminated. Something was illuminated. Okay, this person had a real following. Okay, this person's imbalances, how they feel politically. Maybe they thought... They were putting on a show for entertainment purposes on this platform. Okay, the Ten of Cups is here. This was a soul tribe family. 
people believed in this person. And when this happened, this really sat this person down. Okay, they could very well lose everything. The four of swords is here. Yeah, justice. People feel as though this is an injustice. This person could have been speaking about police brutality through tarot. Um, doing something. Ooh, this person feels as though they have to defend themselves, okay? This person was really, really, like, had a huge following. I feel as though a lot of people could very well be walking away from this person. This person made a lot of money based on past investments. People trusted this person's intuition. And when they had this little, you know, subconscious slip and said something really, really mean, it was a really hard thing for this person to deal with. The nine of swords is some sleepless nights. Okay, losing it. This person could be circumventing with some type of a substance. Okay, now they're trying to clear it up and come back to the platform. Like they didn't say what they said. Spirit is like, listen, ain't no selling to calmer waters until you stand up to what it is that you said. This could very well be the end of this person on a, a public platform. Wow. This person could have done magic over their soul tribe or people that really believed in them. They're now trying to manifest a new beginning. People are walking away in the droves by the group. Okay, show me more, Holy Spirit. Archangel Michael, please and thank you. Yeah, justice is here. Spirit says this is just. Something to do with justice. This person speaking about current events. They're very paranoid that somebody else caught it. They're very paranoid. 1144, just as I said, that confirmation. They're very, very paranoid that somebody caught what they said, they're hoping that everybody didn't hear it. Maybe it's just a few people, right? Yeah. They're trying to put the past behind them with the Six of Cups, but this is a recent current event. They want a new beginning and they're hoping that nobody caught it. They could have deleted the content, okay, of the video where they talked about whatever this race issue was. And again, they had a lot of people following them. This person is trying to move forward. Okay, they're begging for people to stay with them. This represents um, taking time to enjoy their success. The Four of Cups is regret, dissatisfaction, monotony, energy. Lo like they lost their focus of what they started their platform for. And now they don't know what to do. Yeah, they acted very immature. They could have spoken upon some young people in the justice system. Yeah, painting some type of an illusion. This person has an identity crisis. This is somebody of another race, but you could think, oh my God, did you grow up, you know, around a lot of mixed people? Like you got this cultural, you know, uh, thing about you. It's like they're like a gumbo. They're a little bit of this, a little bit of that. But it's definitely some type of identity crisis. The page of swords is them spying on people, other readers, to see if they're going to be exposed. This person is very, very strong, or at least they're trying to be. Gabriel's blowing the horn. Spirit says, what I'm saying is the damn truth. Listen, let this be a lesson on your platform. When you have people of many, you know, walks of life, race-wise, uh, ethnicities, nationalities, let this be a lesson to you. To be mindful, being politically correct. We work for spirit. This ain't about no race war, even though that we know the world is in the 3D and they're being very, very, you know, destructive when it comes to color and race. Again, we're moving into the meek and hurting the earth. So hatred, no matter what color it is, is just not making sense. Yes, there is a history. Yes, there's something that has brought us all down to our knees. Okay, the spirit is saying, let me handle it because where you're going, I need you all to be strong. And what that looks like could be people of all colors, races and walks of life. And this person tried to do something, trying to get along, trying to be, you know, trying to be, you know, cool. And hang with a, a certain type of people and use their lingo. And they're like, no, you can't say that, my love. This person's trying to save face and trying to save their business and trying to save their platform. And they can't come back from it. I don't know if people will be so forgiving at this time in judgment. 
at this time in judgment hour, this says fear. I want this so badly, but I'm afraid of getting hurt. So I self-sabotage. This person self-sabotage themselves. They try to remove the content somehow with the hopes that they could just get up and act like it didn't happen. This is really this person's energy. 1515, as I said, that confirmation. But this is the message. I'm not going to go that deep, but it did come by way. Somebody sent me or I saw something where somebody was talking about this and I just thought that was really interesting. So again, use your discernment. At the end of the day, you are the leader of your own destiny, period. And that's just what it is. Yeah. I always come in peace. Until the next video, as always, peace be with you.